Hey everybody, John M. Bowden with Clay Shooting USA and Trap Shooting USA magazine. Hope everybody's been doing well. Been a long time since I've been on uh, YouTube, so I'm going to resurrect our channels and uh, try to get back out and do some more videos for y'all. Um, we'll kind of have a variety of stuff. Um, I'll let, you know, you guys can comment and tell me kind of more of what you want to do. Um, don't want to repeat the exact same stuff that's in our print editions, but I'm sure we got some exciting things to talk about. Got a couple of the latest editions right here with me. That's the latest clay shooting, which chroma key chromas out some of it, but that's okay. Um, that's going to be the November, December issue. Want to have a big shout out to Zacchaeus Bedford, uh, Thaddeus Bedford's son, who uh, pitched in and did some photography for us when uh, one of my folks couldn't uh, couldn't attend couldn't attend the North Central Regional shoot. So Zacchaeus pitched in and uh, put together some stuff for us. Did a great job. Appreciate his effort. Trap Shooting Magazine, Trap Shooting USA, this is our full coverage in this month for uh, the Grand American Championship in Sparta, the big trap shoot. That's November, December for Trap. Uh, we've got a new issue that we're working on at the moment, going to the printer shortly, and our next issue of Clay will have our extensive coverage of the national championships uh, for this year. I've done a video before on flash targets, and that's a white flyer orange crusher flash target. Now, the difference is the older flash targets had the powder and disc on top. The newer ones have the powder and disc on the bottom. Now, a couple of things. That's going to give you a much more durable target. So if these get wet, uh, you're not going to have as much trouble with these being wet as you would the former ones with, with the uh, powder on top. So these are much more well protected and I, I believe there's more powder in these as well. So they make a bigger flash, for lack of a better terminology, when these break. Um, so just a difference. I have a, I have a video on here earlier when the PSCA was going where I talked about and broke one open and all that, but you, you get the you get the gist of it. There's an orange powder inside there and you hit the target and it makes a nice, you know, non-pyrotechnic splash of orange powder, uh, which shows up really well even in the daytime. It's hard to call. You know, you don't get a lot of chips off of those targets. Whoa. Sporting some uh, hard focus designs uh, gear here. Uh, really great stuff from them. I think they've still got some specials going on until about the 30th of November on their gear uh, at hardfocusdesigns.com. You can check them out for clothing. Pretty good stuff. This is, this is a very nice polo. I don't think they have this type of polo anymore, but this is a great shirt. And the other stuff I've seen from them is really nice as well. I'm going to do a variety of things. Uh, talk a little bit about the industry. Uh, go over some of the press release stuff that comes to me um, as somebody in the industry. Um, just, just a variety of things, you know, we'll, we'll talk to shooters, we'll, you know, got a lot of ideas, but just wanted to kind of get back in here and say, you know, we're going to be back, we're going to do more stuff. You can check out Clay Shooting USA at ClayShootingUSA.com. You can check out Trap Shooting USA at TrapShootingUSA.com. Uh, both are available in print and electronically. Uh, should be across all devices as it's HTML5, so there shouldn't be any issues there. Uh, you can check us out for subscriptions at uh, the respective web addresses. And like I say, back out, you know, back online, back in the video business. Uh, hope to see you out shooting. Uh, appreciate everybody's subscriptions. Looking forward to seeing everybody in the new year. Just got over the national championship, so unfortunately the, the shooting has kind of died down a little bit for most of us. Uh, but we'll, uh, it, it cranks right back up in February in Florida, so look forward to seeing you some, all, some of you all there. Anyway, John M. Bowden, publisher at Clay Shooting USA and Trap Shooting USA Magazine. Appreciate y'all. We'll talk to you soon.